Okay, we have Penny and Thor's puppies here. I've just got the four boys running around. The girls are in the cage there, so it's a little easier for you guys to start picking. Um, it, they were five weeks old this past Thursday. Today's Saturday. And so it is time for the picking to begin. Um, we go in the order I receive the deposits, which I will send in the email that order again in case you're wondering. And uh, if anybody has any questions or anything, please feel free to ask. I'll try my best to describe the personalities I've seen so far. It's blue, purple. Um, and try to help you out. And if you're stumped, let me know, you know, kind of what you're looking for and what your house scenario is like and if you have other dogs and all that stuff and I can try to kind of give you my suggestion on who I think would be a good fit for you. Um, I have two people coming on Tuesday to pick and I think they're number two and number three for opposite boys and girls. Um, and if anyone else is interested in coming, let me know. Otherwise, I'll try my best to take some good pictures and videos for you and uh, and uh, help you out with the picking process. And I'll try to get more videos for you kind of early to mid next week for those of you that are still picking. So these are the four boys. It's blue. That was green. This is purple. And that's red. And uh, well, size-wise, Blue is definitely the smallest. He's the smallest of the whole litter, actually. Although, like, I can see, he's been catching up a little bit lately, and I can see him catching up with the others or not being far off. And size is one of those things you really never have a clue how, how big or small they're going to end up. I have seen it go both ways. I've seen the runt end up huge, and the biggest one just kind of stops growing. I mean, so... Obviously, if size is a big deal for you, that's the only thing you can go off of is how they are now. But just so you know. So, green, red, blue, purple. <laughs> so, these four, they're actually 